This man woke up to find himself tied up in a twist. At the same time, his girlfriend had been arrested, but the black bosses kidnapped them for. Wasn't for money, he was to find out where the man's superpowers, where they came from. Seeing his girlfriend's pitiful face on the phone, the man had to take him to, to the foul ditch with the nuclear waste. The black boss thinks he's been tricked. He didn't believe his bullshit. While the two men were arguing, the black boss's enemy arrived just in time, and the girl at that moment also took care of the boss's men. While the boss and his enemy were fighting in a gun battle, the girl suddenly ran over to him. The black boss saw this and immediately took him hostage. She took the bullet for herself. In the end, both of them were unfortunately shot. As the man lunged for him, his girlfriend said with her last strength, tell him to be a good man from now on. And he closed his eyes. He saw his girlfriend leave him forever. The man's heart was filled with grief. The black boss was also set alight by his enemies and thrown into the water. But unfortunately, the black boss didn't die. Instead, he crawled out of the nuclear wastewater. He also gained superpowers. The first thing he did when he came back to life, he slaughtered his entire family. Then he went to the stadium and planted a time bomb. The only thing he wants to do now is to get back at society. If the stadium explodes, all the fans in the stadium would suffer. The man saw the news on the TV. He immediately borrowed an electric car. He rushed to the stadium. Arriving at the stadium, he saw that it was firmly sealed off. The man immediately moves the wall aside with his bare hands and rushes in. The black boss was also waiting for him. The two men faced each other and immediately engaged in a fight to the death. But after more than an hour of fighting, but for more than an hour they fought. But there was no winner because they were both supernatural beings with divine powers and had the ability to kill themselves. Seeing that they couldn't hurt each other in any way, Boss Black simply stopped fighting. He immediately set the time of the time bomb, set it to four minutes, then he headed for the middle of the pitch. Luckily, the man managed to spot him, grabbed the bomb, he ran as hard as he could towards the unoccupied bridge. But the Black Boss didn't give up the chase either. He tackled him to the ground. He had no choice. The man had no choice but to hold the bomb and the Black Boss and jumped into the water together. As an explosion sounded, the Black Boss's head was blown up into the sky, but the man managed to escape with the current. At the end of the story, the man did not leave the city. Instead, he puts on a mask in a mysterious capacity. He continues to carry on the good and the evil.